Hi and welcome back to the Reham Radio channel. I'm Tamir N6JJ. Uh, in my previous video I showed you uh, the Shurkum SW102 and I mentioned that I'm curious about to check the SWR of the air antenna and this is what we are going to do now. Uh, an important note uh, before we will do that, um, I want to put it clear that when you are checking or comparing an antenna, SWR is not the only factor that you need to look at. There are more important factors like uh, uh, bandwidth, uh, gain, uh, radiation pattern, uh, polarity, polarity in, uh, impedance and, and more. Also remember that SWR can be affected not just by the antenna uh, but also by the quacks and the connectors. So I'm aware about that and the test will give me a good estimation about the behavior of this antenna. The reason that I'm focusing in this video only on the SWR is just curiosity as this antenna, like other antennas, arrived from the, man from the manufacturer pre-tuned, meaning it's already calibrated, ready for use, and we are not required to do uh, any calibration by ourselves. Since I'm not using an antenna analyzer but an SWR meter, I will check the SWR in few frequencies on the band and based on that we can understand what is the frequency that the antenna is tuned for. Since this is a VHF and UHF antenna I will do that on each band. So let's go outside and start with the test. Okay we are outside and uh, my daughter asked me to join to one of the videos so she's going to be my assistant in this test. Come on, come on. So one minute I'm going to set up all the environment and we are going to start with the test. Okay, we have it, we have all the results. Now we are going to back to the uh, computer, put all the details and see what we got. Thank you. So we are back inside and I al already put all the details uh, on the graphs. So let's take a look. For the VHF, we can see easily that the antenna is tuned for the 145 MHz as the SWR is, is lowest at uh, 1.01. .01. In addition, we can learn that the antenna is covering the whole ham radio band with SWR from 1.05 to 1.59 and this is great. Now let's take a look at the UHF graph. We can see that the antenna is tuned for the 450 MHz. This is the end of the UHF ham radio band. It is not the ideal, but if we will take a look at the whole band, we can see that the SWR is from 1.36 to 1.01. .01. And that means that we can use the antenna without any issue all over the band. And this is great as well. As a summary, the Aero antenna came out from the manufacturer pre-tuned for ham radio VHF and UHF bands and we can use it free without any, any additional uh, calibrations. Uh, I hope the, you found this uh, information useful for you and whatever if you're using an antenna already or maybe consider to purchase it in the future. I also want to thank uh, my daughter as my assistant during the tests. Ham radio is a hobby that fits the education program called STEM. STEM stands for science, technology, engineering and mathematics. So we as hams need to encourage young generation whenever they want to join us. I guess and hope that we will see her in the future videos as well. I appreciate if you will subscribe to the channel, it will give a great feedback for us. Thanks for watching and uh, see you soon. Thank you, 73.